Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Really appreciate you uh, checking this lesson out. We're gonna have a lot of fun. ACDC Dirty Deeds. It's epic, it's iconic, so let's do it. If you need a song to practice power chords, I nominate this song. We're gonna start with an E power chord. So we got the open E string, second fret A, second fret D even. <laughs> So that's our first chord, and you're just chucking or chugging on those top strings there. Next is a G power chord, and there's always two guitars, you know, the brothers playing, but we're going to do this one. It's a good one to know. It's the middle finger on the third fret of the E string. And it's just naturally muting the A string and then you get the open D in there. And if you accidentally get the next string, it's the G, so that's just the root again. And so it's really good to practice those two chords together. So, those are the first two chords of the song. So it goes to that G right back to the E. Then it does an A power chord, which is just like the E power chord, but scooted over a string. So now we've got the open A, second fret D, and second fret G. And if you uh, just aim for the top two, that's really good. All right. E, G, e, A, e. See that? And there's a little uh, trick there in power chords, especially where your right hand is just cutting off the sound when it when you don't want it ringing out. You know, that's done with this. So. So the final one is a D power chord, and we're playing open D string, second fret G, third fret B, just like a D chord, but you can either mute that or just not hit it with your pick. You're not hearing that. So all together you get E power chord. E, G, E, A, E, G, E. So E, G, E, A, E, and then finally D, E, and it's the D power chord. So after that, it goes like this, a D power chord on, you know, you have this one, but another kind of D power chord, it's the same notes, different spot. So those are the verses, we're on 5th fret A string, and 7th fret D string, and we slide it up a whole step, and now that's the E power chord. My dad and you the booze. So that's really fun, and another little kind of intricate thing that goes on in power chord techniques is with this particular power chord, my index finger is actually muting that E string. I mean, I'm not aiming for it, but it's helping it not ring out. I could even strum the whole guitar and only those two notes are ringing out. So my index finger is also muting the G, B, and high E. Whoops, I slid a little too far. So 
So finally, da 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 five seven five da 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 on that E power chord. <laughs> Chorus, da da deeds. So, uh, A power chord, and then A power chord, G power chord, A power chord. So check it out. Deeds. A G A. Then the E power chord. Deeds. And we're gonna go E D E. A chord. A G A. Right back into the verse again. So let me go over the chorus one more time. A power chord, A G A, B power chord, B G E, A again, A G A. Now just E ringing out and the dun da G A da da da. Here's the verse again. We'll just go through it. Does it a bunch more times? Scooby Doo. Finally. Uh. Then we get to the solo section, and it changes keys for that. The solo is now on a B power chord, and he's playing the B minor pentatonic. So it's B power chord. So A, 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 B, this is that A power chord. The B power chord, second fret A, fourth fret D. And finally, dun, 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 from D up to E. And let's see, really he's doing the same pattern really, really fast, uh, which would be a stretch here. It'd be the fourth and seventh fret of the high E with a pull off to the open. Maybe use your ring finger. And that just goes up half steps. I think it finally gets to, I believe, uh, the, you know, it starts to get a little wonky up here, but I think. Uh, I think it's the uh, 13 and the 16. And then finally, though, he does a big bend on this uh, 17th fret. Like that. And then no real new parts that you would have to learn. You just need, uh, at the end, it's the opening chords again, kind of as the outro that he's talking over, you know. So when they go dun dun cheap on the end, you know, you're playing the uh, intro stuff, but on the dun dun cheap, it's E D E. All right, I hope you had fun with that one. Uh, one of my favorites and uh, just classic power chords too, you know. Good stuff. Anyway, thank you again, you guys. You can leave requests in the comments below. Uh, Marty Music's my thing, martymusic.com. You can get free courses over there as well if you want. No pressure. Hope to see you again later. 
not the same We changed in so much time Calling out the blame Steady in our aim 